Hey yo, what up people? This is your boy Jason J Kicks and today I'm going to the mall to pick up another pair of shoes that I was not expecting to go and pick up because the shoe doesn't even come in my size but my wife wants the shoe and you know I have to get the shoe for her. I told you earlier that on a video but today is the day man. Today is the day and it's a shoe that like for real if Nike uh, will have produced this shoe on my size immediately for me for me and immediately cop because i like the way the shoe looks i mean it's a yellow shoe with um the fire red for color blocking that's to me that looks like it must cop for me but if you don't like um um the yellow color i can totally understand why you're going to pass on these but these are not bad for real but that's my opinion only what can i say so I probably um I probably made a mistake by showing these shoes earlier to my wife with a friend's pair. I have a friend that works at a sneaker store and he allowed me to use the shoes for the early videos. So my wife saw the shoe earlier and she decided that she wanted the shoe and who has to buy the shoe? This guy right here. So um now because of that you're going to have to come with me to pick up the shoes so that's what we're going to do today so um let's just walk a little bit till i get to the train to go to the mall so you're coming with me guys and for today's pickup block i decided that i was going to wear my storm blue ones long time without wearing this one but i pull them out today because i mean man this is one of my favorite shoes i love the color block and the colorway on the shoe really fire shoe a lot of people seem to forget about this one and this this shoe right here on my feet is one of the shoes that i like to use as example um when people call shoe bricks shoe sitting they call them bricks this shoe was sitting for a long time really really long time and what's going on right now the shoe is going for a ton of money on the resale market and people now seem to love them this shoe went for bricks to grail that's why i don't like the the resale market that's why I don't like the disrespect when people call shoes bricks just because they're sitting and they treat them like they're trash because of that. To me, shoe sitting is amazing. Amazing. You already know. I have said that a million times. You already know the way I feel about it. So let me just go and wait for the train to get to the mall so we can um, keep talking about anything. And I'm also going to show you the shoes. and. I'm gonna show you some shoes sitting in the stores too, so this is gonna be a really fun video if you like sneakers, so stay here with me. By the way, I want to know how was um, your experience yesterday if you, live, um, if you live in the New York or New Jersey area? How was your experience yesterday with, uh, um, with the Earthshake? That was crazy. First time I felt one right here um, in the United States, especially here in New York. I didn't even thought that, that was possible here because of the position of the CD, but I don't know. I, I don't know that much about that, but that one catch me by surprise. I was actually sleeping when that happened. I woke up and I was like, damn, these damn trains. And I was like, hold on. I'm not in the Bronx anymore. There's no trains near my house. And the, the whole room was boom, 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 shaking. I was like, what the fuck's going on? But <laughs> thanks God. Um, we all good. I haven't seen any um, catastrophe, um, people losing their life and, or property, nothing of that. So thanks God, everything was good. But if you were here, if you experienced that today or you have ever experienced one of those, let me know how you felt about that. That's crazy, it was crazy for me. So I'm ready at the mall, ready to go in, get the shoes, see what else they have in stores. Man, what a nice day. I mean, 
I know it's not sunny, but I like this kind of days. Forget about it, forget about it. Let's just go in. There's another shoe that I'm looking for to see if I can get them today. If I see these here, I'm going to buy them. And I'm talking about the Devon Booker shoes. I really want those. Crazy, but I want those. What can I say? This new colorway, the black and gold, I think it's pretty nice. It's like a DMP colorway. I think it's a nice shoe and I haven't reviewed one of those and I want to review a pair for the channel. I know I know some people like those, including me. I, want, I haven't seen them in hand yet, but I want to. And those are pretty nice. That's all I'm saying. Also, I'm looking for the two threes, the white and red pair. I want to review those shoes as well. I'm very curious to see those in person because I think they really improved the shoe by replacing the Jordan 2 midsole for the Jordan 3 midsole. I think it's pretty nice the way they look, so I want to see those and review those for you. So let's see if I can get those too. And the first stop will be Snipes. We probably go to Shams too, but Snipes is the first destination, so let's just go in. And they seem to have a lot of shoes sitting here. Hello. So, oh, they have these still for real? Man, this came out a long time ago. And these are still sitting here. Better review on those, on those, on those. Most of these, even these. These are still sitting crazy shoe. I like those a lot. This, the quality on these is just next level. Look at that. That quality right there, amazing. The comfort on these, pretty good. And one of my favorite sleepers of the year so far. Love the color black and colorway on this one. And you know I love black and white. What can I say, man? But these. I understand if you sleep on these, these are, you know, you can like it or hate it for the same, for the same reasons probably, the colorway, but yeah, but these, these are sleeper of the year, these are in my top 10 of the year so far, I love this shoe man, pretty, pretty fire shoe, everything on it, really good, really beautiful, including the quality man, the quality is incredible, really, really incredible, classic shoes we have classic shoe right here and you slept on these too don't surprise me but i'm just saying i see a lot of people hating on the you don't want lows but have you seen the quality on these lows that was the main downside of the you don't want low retros but this one has really nice quality made a review on these too you can go and check that out on the channel so now i'm in shamsen see this is the reason why i'm not mad i'm not having the you don't for because like i told you i have these shoes on my collection and also these okay i'm cool look at that those are sitting that's crazy and these this classic shoes going for on the retail already in stores let me know about that so it's time to go to um foot locker and pick up um, my reservation for these jordan 4 vivid sulfur man and, uh, the name is crazy but uh, the shoe is nice my wife told me something that is the, the the main reason why I want her to get these shoes is because she told me that will be really cool for her, in her opinion, um, to have these Jordan 4 that are white and yellow because I have the, the yellow thunder which are black and yellow. So she thinks will be really cool for us to go outside together with both of the shoes, one being black and yellow and the other one being um, white and yellow. You get a point. Let's get let's get to the locker. And again, right here they have a ton of shoes, but those seating still here. Small numbers, but some size seating. Uh, let me just go and ask for my shoe and get out of here. So they do have the decent items here. Let me see them. Okay. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna review this for you guys. So I couldn't get the um, Jordan 2 3s, but I got the Devon Booker. So that was a pretty nice shoe. Going to do a review, going to tell you my opinion. There's some things that I was not feeling about the shoe. We're going to talk about all that in the review. I'm going to show you a little bit about it when I got home. And I got my wife, um, Jordan 4 Bibit Sulfur Spare, right here on my back. So um, let me just get home and show you both of the shoes. And we back at the crib with both of the shoes. These are the book, the D book shoes, and you have seen this already. Um, let me give you another quick look on the shoe. Oh man, 
there's another time. I made a ton of video about these, so um, hold on. Cool. So these are the BB Sulfur Jordan 4. I made a review on these, a unfit look on these, and also um, yesterday I made a um, video talking about this shoe and I made a little um, lace swap um, section on that video so you can go and check that out if you want to know about these I talk a little about these too much I told you I like this shoe but it didn't come with my size um, my wife wanted this shoe and now baby here you have them cool now let's go with the new shoe for me because this is a totally new shoe for me because I haven't seen this shoe well yes I saw it a few moments ago in the stores but after that, this was the first time I saw the shoe, so I can see that the box is very similar to the box that we have for the um, Jordan 1 Low 85 cut. The box is identical, just that this time um, the box on the shoe comes in this um, brown color for the Nike lettering. And right here we have book in orange and um, chapter 1 in that same brown color that we have on the top of the box. That signature right here. I'm gonna do the full review on this shoe, don't worry. This will be just a quick look and first impressions on the Devin Booker's first signature shoe. This one is this black and gold colorway, very similar to the LeBron 20 with the same colorway, similar in terms of colorway, just that. By the way, that shoe is going on the retail right now. LeBron fans are not buying his shoes, but whatever. This is the first time I see the shoe and I gotta say that I like the silhouette because it's kind of similar to a few shoes, including the Jordan 1 Lowe's, but um, I'm gonna go a little deeper into that, but I gotta say that it's a pretty nice looking shoe that I, I want to try these shoes on. I want to try them on. On the stores, I show you, they, they look kind of good. They look good and they feel good. But I want to test them a little bit more. So let's just wait, let's just wait. Tomorrow, I promise you, I'm going to drop the review on these shoes. So stay tuned for that, guys. Um, what else can I say? Thank you a lot for watching the video. Double pick up for today's video, but man, pretty dope shoes, both of these. Let me know if you can go for one of these only, which one will you go for? These or these? I was looking for three shoes and I got two of them. So two out of three is not bad. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put my hands on those Jordan 2 3s anyway. So thank you guys a lot for watching the video. Subscribe for more videos like this. Reviews, on fit look, late swap, all sneaker content that you can imagine, you're going to get it on this channel. So if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe right now, guys. Thank you a lot for watching. By the way, if you want to know more about me and my content outside of YouTube, you can always follow me right here on my Instagram, JasonJKX. I'm always uploading videos, picture, sneaker information like shock drop, early access, all the upcoming releases. You're going to know about the first right here on my Instagram, JasonJKX. Also, you can find some of my content on TikTok, same name in all the social medias, JasonJKX. Thank you guys for watching and till the next one. <laughs> Goodbye.